today's vlog will be half filmmaking and half vlog. I think filmmaking is a part of taking photos because taking photos is a part of filmmaking. That's yeah, that's opposite. But I think photos is like for Instagram, for Twitter, for Facebook, for posting on internet. Like people might like it, so they will come in and give you a thumbs up. So so let's straight into it. How to take this photo? So this photo is. Taken by me, and I use my camera. And yeah, like you need to focus on ISO. You need manual focus, so you cannot sit auto focus because the auto focus won't be great because you will focus on the subject, but the background won't be like a painting background. But as you see, so the photos is focus on the subject, but the background is blur, like. Like blurred, just like a painting background. So, so I think that's the most interesting things in photos in taking whatever I like. But I like to take photos as well. Like so, before I have take a photo about like an action camera. So that action camera filming on the roof, but behind the scene, I just take a photo about that camera and that sunset. It just like a painting sunset. So it looks perfect. If you haven't seen it, just go to my Instagram account and just look at it. It just looks fantastic. So I love it. Like photos is a part of filmmaking. So I can improve my filmmaking skills and I can improve my thank you photos skills. This videos will separate for two parts. Half is about filmmaking. So I will talk about filmmaking first about photos but second part will be what so I took that photos from this lens this lens like Sony 55 meters to 210 meters this one part my favorite lens so this lens is quite expensive and I'll tell you all the settings about my camera so at that time I took this photos like 55 meters and I shoot on the subject <laughs> These two things is a. I'm not sponsored by the company or any company, but just taking photos and just teach you guys how to take cinematic photos or footage. But and about the settings is like ISO is like three thousand, but exposure I plus zero point seven. So let you know how bright this is from this camera. So this is all about my camera system or camera settings but of course all the things I take about filmmaking or taking photos I always set it at manual so I won't use auto focus or auto ISO or auto frame rate but I will set all manual because that's better and looks better but the quality will be better as well so basically all the looks and all the things it looks from the camera to outside but sometimes I'll do about color grading but I'll talk about color grading the other day because it takes too long to explain color grading and the system all the things is very important because color grading is a part to make your photos pop up more and looks better so if you want to take this kind of photos like a painting background you need to use like focal lens and this lens is about very tight like it focus on one subject only so if you want to take this kind of picture and you just need to have a tight lens but not this wide lens like it is how wide is it from this lens so this lens I vlog from 16 to 50 meters so this lens is like double of this lens and yeah this lens is very very impressive I'm impressed for this lens and so this lens can take massive things and I'm vlogging from 16 to 50 meters lens so it's quite wide but from this lens you will see it's quite small and my face will be very big and that won't look good if I vlog from this lens. 
of course, like if you have basic filmmaking skills, you know what will look like from this lens and it won't look good when I vlog because I'm taking a far away to vlog. It just doesn't look good. So, so the top three things I think is need, you need a tight lens and a camera and self and you need to set the setting properly. Like I said, like ISO, manual focus, frame rate and the bright or less bright or dark. But you need to make sure the setting is good so it will look good. So you need to make sure these three things is in your camera setting properly, the lens is setting properly and all this thing will help your photos get better quality in the future. And you will take a photo like me as professional, but not really professional, but just need a proper lens, proper camera, proper setting. That's all. So about today's vlog, like today I went to school and just have a simple school life, like every day, just improving every day and speaking, writing, reading, those kind of things, but still improving, but as a result, we won't know when the result will come out and what the result will be. So if the result come out, like end of this term, and I will show you guys and I will talk about it, so I can share my whole life, anything on the vlog. So later I got head to dinner and head to shower and editing my videos, my homework. I will see you guys tomorrow. Peace out.